Before we start our topic today, please smash the like button and subscribe to help the channel grow. And thanks for your support. Jimmy Donaldson, born May 7, 1998, age 23, better known online as Mr. Beast, formerly known as Mr. Beast 6000 and Beast, is an American YouTuber and philanthropist known for his videos that often consist of him doing arduous tasks for an extended amount of time, doing or saying something thousands of times, challenges and donations that involve millions of dollars and more. With unrelenting passion and devotion to finishing arduous, yet creative, challenges, Jimmy has become an extremely popular YouTuber in recent years. He is known for giving away lots of money, making people do challenges and tasks for money and buying large objects. The channel is mostly run by Jimmy, his friend Chris Tyson and several other affiliates, who makes outrageous experiments, challenges, or donations that usually involve incredible amounts of money. Currently, his main channel is the ninth most subscribed channel, excluding YouTube topic channels, with 77 million subscribers, as of November 25, 2021. He started this YouTube channel on February 19, 2012 at the age of 13. He also has a second channel called Beast Reacts, formerly Beast Hacks, Mr. Beast and Mr. Beast CSGO, where Jimmy and his friends react and review things like compilations and roast them if they are disgusting or bad. In May 2020, he started a gaming channel named Mr. Beast Gaming, which has over 23 million subscribers, releasing three gaming videos every month. He also has the channel Mr. Beast Shorts where he uploads around 10 to 60 second clips of him and his friends doing random things, and some of those videos are posted on his TikTok. Along with a play button focused English YouTuber Jack Sucks at Life, he created the channel Don't Subscribe, and he gives 10 cents to Jack for every subscriber. As of August 20, 2021, the channel has 1 million subscribers, meaning Jack has made $100,000. This is the limit to the amount of money he can make. Surprisingly, Jack doesn't have access to the channel. Also, Jack says in some of his videos, videos subscribe to don't subscribe. His brother, CJ Donaldson, also has a channel inspired by his brother, called Mr. Bro. He started his channel in 2017, but only started posting in August of 2019. He also makes challenge videos, like his brother. Jimmy is also known for making fun of Minecraft, a game developed by Mojang. He made a two-episode series playing it, and was finished playing the game for good after his house got blown up by a creeper. Due to that incident, he has since deleted the game. Since then, Jimmy has made a sudden return to Minecraft, collaborating with fellow YouTuber Dream in the video titled 3 Minecraft Speedrunners vs Hunter Foot Mr. Beast featured on Dream's YouTube channel. It seems like Jimmy is starting to like Minecraft more than he did a few years back. He has since made a channel called Mr. Beast Gaming, where he does challenges with his viewers and friends for money. The challenges are usually in Minecraft and involve parkour, building or fighting, usually for money, gift cards, food, and for no reason. One of the stranger prizes was a free supply of yogurt for 10 years. One of the craziest challenges done on the gaming channel was the $100,000 gift card hunt on the Dream SMP. The prize was $100,000 worth of gift cards from different stores. The challenge was ultimately won by Tubbo, who decided to selflessly give away all of his earnings on one of his live streams. YouTube Career Early career, 2012 to 2017. Donaldson uploaded his first ever YouTube video in February 2012, at the age of 13, under the handle MrBeast6000. His early content ranged from Let's Plays, mainly focused on Minecraft and Call of Duty, videos estimating the wealth of other YouTuber, YouTubers, videos that offered tips to upcoming YouTube creators, and commentary on YouTube drama. During this early period of his channel, Donaldson himself made few appearances in his videos. As of July 2013, the subscriber count of his channel, then named that dude, was around 240. In 2015 and 2016, Donaldson began to gain popularity on the platform due to his worst intro series of videos, which rounded up and poked fun at YouTuber introductions he discovered on the site. By mid-2016, Donaldson had around 30,000 subscribers. In fall 2016, 
Donaldson dropped out of East Carolina University without telling, which Donaldson said occurred after only two weeks of being there, to pursue a full-time career as a YouTuber. As a result, his mother made him move out of his family home. Rise to Fame, 2017 Present In January 2017, Donaldson published an almost day-long video of himself counting to 100,000. The stunt took him 40 hours, with some parts sped up to keep it under 24 hours. A subsequent video titled Counting to 200,000, Road to a Mill, was uploaded the next month, although, according to Donaldson, it too, had to be sped up because the full 55 hours of counting exceeded YouTube's upload limit. Donaldson also gained popularity during this period with stunts, such as attempting to break glass using 100 megaphones, watching paint dry for an hour, attempting to stay underwater for 24 hours, which ended up failing due to health issues, and an unsuccessful attempt to spin a fidget spinner for a day. By 2018 Donaldson had given out $1 million through his outlandish stunts, which earned him the title of YouTube's biggest philanthropist. During PewDiePie vs. T-Series in 2018, a competition to become the most subscribed channel on YouTube, Donaldson bought billboards, numerous ads and radio advertisements to help PewDiePie gain more subscribers than T-Series. During Super Bowl 53, he bought multiple seats for him and his team whose shirts spelled out, Sub 2 PewDiePie. In March 2019, Donaldson organized and filmed a real-life battle royale competition in Los Angeles with a prize of $200,000, two games were played, making game earnings of $100,000 for each game, in collaboration with Apex Legends. The event and prize pool was sponsored by Apex Legends publisher Electronic Arts. Donaldson was accused of using counterfeit money in a November 2019 video. He later explained that he used fake money to mitigate the potential safety and security risks caused by a rush of people clamoring to get the free money, and claimed that he exchanged the counterfeit bills for a real check for everyone afterwards. In April 2020, Donaldson created a rock, paper, scissors competition stream that featured 32 influencers and a grand prize of $250,000, which at the time became YouTube's most watched live original event with 662,000 concurrent viewers. The event was ultimately won by Nade Shot. In October 2020, Donaldson created another influencer tournament featuring 24 competitors with a grand prize of $300,000. The tournament was ultimately won by the D'Amelio family, which caused controversy due to claims that that they cheated. On January 1, 2021, Donaldson released the video YouTube Rewind 2020, thank God it's over. He previously announced in November 2020 that he would be making a Rewind Days after YouTube announced they would not be making one. In Donaldson's video, he explains that he had always believed that YouTubers should get more say in Rewind, and with this in mind, he decided to call hundreds of YouTubers. At the end of the video, Donaldson gives a shout-out to PewDiePie, citing him and his 2018 Rewind as the inspiration for Donaldson's Rewind, both rewinds featuring the, the editors Flying Kitty, Dolan Dark, and Grande, and a song by Party in Backyard. In February 2021, Donaldson made a guest appearance on the Clubhouse app causing it to crash. In March 2021, Donaldson signed a deal with Jellysmack which allows the company to exclusively manage distribution of his video content on Snapchat and Facebook. In November 2021, Donaldson uploaded a recreation of the survival drama streaming television series Squid Game in Real Life, in which 456 people competed for a $456,000 cash prize without actually shooting anyone. Content and Style Donaldson's videos typically feature attention-grabbing stunts. He often makes videos where he donates large amounts of money to individuals, with many of these videos being sponsored by various companies. He also sometimes hosts competitions and games, such as Minecraft, for big money prizes which includes donating a house in one of his gaming videos. A typical video involves Donaldson giving away large sums of money, such as giving $100,000 worth of items to homeless shelters in December 2018, donating $32,000 to the Veterans Army Wounded Warrior Program, $70,000 to St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, and $10,000 to a local animal shelter in Los Angeles. His expensive YouTube videos are mostly funded and sponsored through large-scale brand deals that appear as in-video ads on his videos. 
In 2021, Donaldson claimed that he runs his main channel at a loss. Mr. Beast has been credited with launch a new style of high-cost stunt videos on YouTube, where creators pull off elaborate challenges and large-scale sponsored giveaways. As his channel has grown Donaldson was able to hire four of his childhood friends, Chris, Chandler, Garrett and Jake, to work for him and the channel, which has led to them being regularly shown in his videos, former cameraman Carl Jacobs was added into the rotating cast later, in late 2019 as Jake and Garrett left to pursue their own YouTube careers. Carl has become a success successful YouTuber in his own right. YouTuber Mr. Beast recreates Squid Game with $456,000 top prize. Hundreds of cash-strapped Squid Game fans competed in a real-life recreation of the dystopian smash-hit Netflix series for a $456,000 cash prize. Popular YouTuber Mr. Beast, who boasts 76.4 million subscribers, said he spent $3.5 million on the elaborate reenactment in which 456 contestants battled for the jackpot. The social media star, whose real name is Jimmy Donaldson, said on Twitter that it cost him around $2 million to build and produce, while he spent around $1.5 million on prizes. In addition to the six-figure first prize, Donaldson doled out $2,000 to every competitor and $10,000 to the runner-up. The recreation included the same Korean children's games played in Squid Game, such as Red Light, Green Light, Marbles and Tug of War in huge sets that took weeks to construct. But unlike in the unsettling drama, no contestants were harmed. Players were instead rigged with wireless explosives packed with fake blood that burst open when a player was eliminated. In the tug-of-war and glass bridge challenges, losing contestants fell into a foam pit rather than plummeting to their deaths. UT true to form, the real-life Squid Game contestants were seen in footage of the game trembling as they tried to carve shapes out of honeycomb in the Dalgona challenge. The Squid Game reenactment isn't the first time Donaldson has pulled off an extravagant stunt like this for his YouTube channel. Donaldson is famed for offering outlandish prizes to his online followers willing to compete in absurd challenges, such as when contestants stood in a circle for 12 days for $500,000 cash. The social media sensation was the second highest paid YouTube star in 2020 earning about $24 million and garnering some 3 billion views, according to Forbes. But his latest video has attracted harsh criticism from viewers, who slammed Donaldson for re-enacting a game about rich people exploiting the poor for their macabre viewing pleasure. Other critics also noted the irony of Donaldson making ad revenue by recreating a show that sternly denounces capitalism. Business Ventures Mr. Beast has been called an early form of future creator entrepreneurs. Finger on the app. In June 2020, Donaldson, in collaboration with Brooklyn-based art collective MSCHF, released a one-time multiplayer mobile game titled Finger on the app which tasked players to hold a finger to their phone screen in the app, with the last person to take it off winning $25,000. In the end, four people ended up winning $20,000 each after keeping their finger on the app for over 70 hours. The game was reportedly so successful that a sequel titled Finger on the App 2 was planned to originally launch in December 2020. However, the game was postponed to February and then further delayed to March 2021 due to a flood of downloads, causing the game to crash and requiring the game's developers to upgrade their servers. This time, the game featured a grand prize of $100,000. The game was ultimately won by a 19-year-old man who went under the username Swagbacon123 on Twitter after around 51 hours of competition. The second-place finisher also received a prize of $20,000. Mr. Beast Burger Will Hyde, a producer for the Mr. Beast channel, announced in a November 2020 article with The Wake Weekly that Donaldson would launch a virtual restaurant called Mr. Beast Burger in December 2020. Hyde said his team worked with virtual dining concepts during the development of the restaurant concept. Mr. Beast Burger will sell franchise rights to serve the burgers to restaurants across the U.S. and customers will be able to order the burgers via online delivery services. Investments and Partnerships Donaldson is an investor of tech startup Backbone which produces the Backbone One, a controller that makes smartphones appear more similar to Nintendo Switch controllers, and the Backbone app, a content creation and social tools app for its users. 
In March 2021, Donaldson partnered with Creative Juice Financial Network to introduce Juice Funds, a $2 million investment fund that offers creators up to $250,000 in exchange for equity in their YouTube channels. In April 2021, Donaldson became a long-term investor and partner of financial technology company Current. The same month, Donaldson received backlash after fans lost large amounts of money in a cryptocurrency scheme that Donaldson had invested in and promoted. Thank you for watching see you again for another interesting facts and amazing stories and also please like and subscribe.